and welcome back, guys. I'm your host, Keyblade Kyrie 2010. Today we are continuing with Detroit Become Human as our next gameplay. Viewer discretion is advised. This gameplay is rated M for mature. If you're under the age of 17, you probably should not be watching this. This does contain quite a bit of violence, quite a bit of language and uh, a little bit of bloodshed as well. If you are triggered by any of these things, please go and check out my rated T for teen games and my rated E for everyone games. If you are okay with that and you are fine and dandy with the, how that's going, then uh, let's continue on with Detroit Become Human. You have been warned. All right, let's do this. Jumping back into another episode. We are like very intrigued now and like so into the story right now. <laughs> I, and here I thought it was uh, gonna be shorter than that, but. Gave us a bamboozle. It gave us a really big bamboozle. So. I'm glad I decided to pick this game with everything that's been going on in the world and everything. It just, I don't know, I guess it makes me understand a little bit more through a video game versus experience in real life. I don't know. All right, Marcus. What are we doing? Do you want some time alone? There's a magazine on the ground. Oh, I wonder how he's doing. Oh, troubling music. Like, I think he's like thinking of if he's doing, if he's done the right thing or. I was wondering where you were. Think alone daylight. I needed to think. I like it here. I come here often. It's like being alone with the world. We freed hundreds of our people and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. You seem preoccupied. Followers, next step, fly sincere. They all obey me, they follow me without question. And that much power feels good. And scary at the same time. All the media are talking about what we did last night. The humans are terrified. They're afraid of a civil war. Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. The humans hate us. They'll never give us our freedom. Optimistic, pessimistic, fatalistic, determined. No, not all humans are the same. Some of them understand that they can't stop us from becoming free forever. You haven't said much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? Yet yeah, yeah, you won't tell me yours, exactly. Truth, sincere, avoid, not important. 
I was living in a bubble in this world that belonged only to me. When you're happy, it's difficult to see other people's misery. Once past, leave. What about you? You never told me about your past. What did you do before? I don't want to talk about it. Other North, trust, aggressive, curious. That android you were looking at in the store. She reminded you of who you were, didn't she? Trust, aggressive, curious, understanding. North, we're fighting together. We have to know things about each other to trust each other. I was nothing. A doll in a distributor program to satisfy humans. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. One day I was with a man who rented me. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. I strangled him and I ran away. There, now you know everything. <sighs> I shouldn't have told you. Connect. your memories. Carl's house, when they left you for dead in his studio. I saw your memories, too. The Eden Club, the, the death of that man. I felt like I was there with you. North. Did you see that it went yeah, from, to from to lovers? ship it not my intentions but I'm a compassionate person damn it sometimes I this is suicide so. we'll <laughs> all be killed please Marcus it's not too late to change your mind you don't understand we're finally gonna show them who we really are this place will go down in history we'll be killed on the spot that's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people Marcus please don't do this They'll understand. We'll make them understand. Right? She changed her mind. This Real quick. is the only way. She... There are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. Like, she changed her tune real quick. You're free. You're free. Oh, oh. Looking for any others. Don't see any, so I might have to push a little farther down. You know, I bet President Moore is a great subject. Come to bed, sons. So, what am I doing? There's one right here in front of me. Androids. Come with us. She's just on the fucking phone. You're awake now. I don't think there's any more in here, but I'm looking. Yeah, I don't see any more. Yeah, she's still on her phone. She does not yet notice that I just did that, by the way. 
block the road. There's an android over here. There's an android here. You are free. This gal on her fucking phone, too! It's amazing how our technology is, like, somewhat... You're free now. ...changing things. Hey! Where do you think you're going? You get back here! Leave him alone. He's chosen to be free. You're free. Um, oh, wow. I need to block the street. Jesus. Like she's still on her freaking phone. You don't have to obey them. You're free. Trying to get as many as I freaking can. Those are some interesting pants, by the way, that he's wearing. Kinda like them. I want a pair for me. Convert more and It's Kara. You're free now. It's a car model. It's a car model. I'm kind of a bit blown away myself. the more people <laughs> I might start crying this is insane this is really actually really cool to be honest Wandering off here a little bit. <laughs> Turned around. Oh, I got a lot of androids down here. God, I 
don't know, hundreds, thousands, and they're marching. Yeah, they're marching down the street. No, fuck you, fine. No. We came here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. Disperse immediately or we will open fire. We're not looking for confrontation. We've done no harm. We have no intention of doing any. But know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom. I repeat, this is an illegal gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, we will shoot. Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. There's more of us, we can take them. If we attack, we'll start a war. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand our ground, even if it means dying here. This is your last chance. I don't wanna end up killing Marcus. immediately, or you will all be killed! Disperse. What do you... <sighs> we have to show them we won't back down. We stay right here. Disperse! This is your last chance! We have to make a statement. We have to stay put no matter what. I don't want to kill Please, Marcus. Marcus. We can't let them slaughter us without fighting back. Attack, stand ground, disperse. We're not moving. Marcus, what are you doing? They're gonna kill us all. Charge, sacrifice, run away. Is having an issue with me, and so is she. Really? I can't please anybody. Come on, Marcus. We gotta go. The public saw them. Yeah. That's that's a big, big thing right now. Oh wow. Yeah, there's a lot. You could actually continue to stand your ground, it looks like. I probably would have died. There's something else here. Interesting. Hmm. There's two things here for the mall. I must have missed something. Oh my god, that made me really tear up. Like, I was literally super close of, like, actually crying. And probably one of those is a death. I don't know. I'll go back through. We have enough time to continue. Again? I'm gonna go play around with this thing again. I'm making it a goal now at the at this point to screw around with it. All 
I think it's our back door. Now he's not afraid of it anymore. He's like all in now. Like, whatever. Oh. I was like, what are you doing out on the lake? Shoot, I'd be worried it's gonna crack. After what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. <gasps> oh, that was probably the one of giving, getting the I thought Kemsky knew something. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. I chose not to play his twisted little game. There was no reason to kill that android. Distrust him. Kemsky caught our series Amanda's picture of this place. Did Kemsky design this place? He created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? Connor series Amanda's picture of Cyberlife Kemsky. I saw a photo of Amanda at Kemsky's place. She was his teacher. When Kamsky designed me, he wanted an interface that would look familiar. That's why he chose his former mentor. What are you getting at? Ah, we are in the Connor series, Cyberlife Secret, Kamsky. You didn't tell me everything you know about Deviants, did you? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. You're the only one who can prevent civil war. Find the Deviants. Or there will be chaos. This is your last chance, Connor. I have a feeling she's gonna try and shut me down if I'm not careful. Yeah. You're off the case. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're onto something. Wait, we just need more time, I'm sure we Hank, can... you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now, not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to cyber life. I'm sorry, Hank. But it's over. I crossed the line. It's done. Mm, yep. We're friends. We're still friends. Well, there's a path unlocked, which means there's still something to do. I'm gonna go back to cyber. I don't wanna go back to cyber life. They're gonna shut me down. They're gonna shut me down, man. I'm officially a deviant now at this point, but. I'm gonna still swear up and down I'm not. Hit sitting on the desk. Frustrated, more time, explained, no choice. We can't just give up like that. I know we could have solved this case. So you're going back to cyber life? I have no choice. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? What if we're fighting against people who just want to be free? Not people, defective, regrets, no doubt. I know we're on the right side. Oh! Humans created us. Not what I wanted. They're our masters. No machine should That's rebel against I... its creator. Fuck. Yep, you, you. When you refuse to kill that android, it can't I meant to say, like, there's no doubt in my mind that, you know... Yeah. Oh, I said the wrong thing. Well... <sighs> you want to? I really don't want to. I'm, I'm worried that I might... It was only my first little hiccup, okay? Yeah, it's like... place. You put yourself in her shoes. You showed empathy, Connor. Empathy's a human emotion. Not deviant, determined, troubled, cold. I don't know why I did it. Sincere friends, good officer, Hank's secret. 
I'm not programmed to say things like this, but I really appreciated working with you. With a little more time, who knows? We might have even become friends. <laughs> well, well, here comes Perkins, that motherfucker. Sure don't waste any time at the FBI. We can't give up. I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. You've got to help me, Lieutenant. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. Listen, Connor. If I don't solve this case, Cyberlife will destroy me. Five minutes. That's all I ask. Five minutes. God, I don't know what I'm fucking looking for. I don't know what I'm looking for. The key to the basement is on my desk. Get a move on. I can't distract him forever. Five minutes? Are you freaking kidding me? You're making me nervous. I was the archives. Where's the archives? I wonder where the fuck is the archives. Where the back here? Back here? Yeah, archives room. Hey, Kano. I'm talking to you, asshole. Where are you going? Please. Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, no, or did no, anybody tell you? Sorry. All right, go for a while, Tom. I'm registering the evidence in my possession. But don't worry. I'm going to leave. Though I'm certainly going to miss our bromance. <laughs> bitch! <laughs> Ooh! Start using that of us doing die moments. Hank's password. What would a hard-boiled eccentric police lieutenant choose? Oh, date of birth one two four five six. Fucking password. Hank Anderson. Oh, it's circle. I got it right. Somewhere. That's fucking funny. Not much time. Okay. Um, how do I? How do I? Got okay. Deviant took a child hostage. Yeah, he's probably not gonna be helpful because he's <coughs> he doesn't have anything to do with Jericho. I don't think he knew about Jericho just quite yet. other things. The one thing I learned from it before. Jericho, if I could just figure out where this memory was recorded. Oh, fuck. Am I unlocking? 
unlock something else. What else did I unlock? Well, that's all the stuff you've looked at. The unlock is what you've looked at. Nothing in it. Right? There's something in it. There's something in it. Oh my God! There's something in it. Jericho is somewhere in the front of the memory. We found it. Now we can found scan it. their memories and narrow the search. Scan their memories and note. Okay. The android that murdered its owner. Impossible reactivation. You can take its parts to. Oh no, this is a puzzle. Go, go to him. See what parts he needs. One of the deviants that hacked the TV station with Marcus. Are you kidding me? Must have known where the deviants are hiding. I'm gonna need your help massively. I'm on a timer. 3983Z. So. Uh, so he needs what? So go to the first one. This one? Way over here? Yeah. Three is square. Square. Oh! So go Jesus. to... Um, the end one? Yeah, go to him. And put it in? Yeah, hit X. Okay, now what? You probably have to scan this It's dark. Out. Where? Where am I? Activated you so you could help me. I must find Jericho. I don't recognize your voice. You're not one of us. I'll never tell you where Jericho is. Now leave me alone. Oh, this might. This might hurt. I'm forcing information out of him. It was successful. Did we get it? Yeah, we got it. Now what? I'm done. I've been I dreaming did. about this since the first second I saw you. Don't do it, Gavin. I know how to stop the deviants. You're off the case. And now, it's gonna be definitive. <gasps> don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Oh shit! Oh fuck, fuck, fuck! Shit! I've come too far! I will restart this. I have no problem doing it. Okay. I see how straight this time. I <laughs> hate straight this time. That's my yeah, main here. Ooh. It looks up. like someone's been snooping around. Oh shit. Get the alarm. Now! We got it! We got our info! Yes! We got our info. I was worried. I was like, I need help. I need help. I need help. I can't brain right now. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. There's a lot of shit. Yeah. This one either ended wow. in you getting out or you probably get getting killed. And the other one is probably running out of time. No, no. Uh, yeah. One of them's running out of time for sure. I got a trophy and I looked at less stuff. I was pretty happy with myself. Yay. I had a gut feeling when like, he was shaking it. I didn't want to tell you what to do, but like... I needed your help on, at least I on that it. one, yeah. No, I wanted you to tell me on that one. Um, do you think there's enough time to continue? I don't know, do you? Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Whatever we can get recorded is... Yeah, no, you weren't telling me what to do. You were telling me the proper uh, input, which is what I wanted. Oh, like, the thing was, I wasn't sure. Yeah. With all androids being turned over to the authorities, the country is grinding to a halt. Hospitals and schools are closing. Water cuts, blackouts, and network failures are expected. 
Maybe most worrying of all, our armed forces have lost two-thirds of their effective personnel. How about some music instead? Okay. Probably. I'm pretty sure you're correct on that one. I'm kind of glad, to be honest. I'm glad you grabbed the statue, though. I wouldn't have held that. No, I just, something just told me, grab the statue, and I was like... And then he start. it said, shake! I was like, oh, okay! So I'm gonna shake it! Like... Ooh, there's something inside. And then he broke it, I was like, ooh! That's even better! We got more info! They've been conducting raids all over the city. <gasps> Everybody's on edge after what happened yesterday. Oh my god. It's gonna be alright. We're almost there. I'm heartbreaking now. Like, literally, I'm starting to feel for my android brethren. <laughs> like, I'm really starting to feel for them. Okay. A little further on that way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. When you get there, find Marcus. He will help you. The last bus for the border leaves at midnight. You absolutely have to be on it. You'll be safer on the other side. Okay. It's not much. But it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his address. He'll be able to hide you until things calm down. Thank you. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. You deserve to be happy. Thank you for everything, Rose. Thank you. Let me know when you make it over there, all right? <laughs> and be careful. Take care of them. Yes, mama. <laughs> Come on, girls. You better not hang around. Where are we going? Yeah, but we'll see. Locate. Oh, I hate when I can't seem to find things. Find Jericho. Oh, he's doing it automatically now, it looks like. Yeah, well, we've already been through it, so. Whoa! We're gonna probably bounce back and forth. Yeah. Oh, I like this a lot. This is really cool. Oh, oops. What? Locate Jericho. That you're just here now. Okay. Do what you're doing. Yeah, we're gonna go back and forth between the two, I bet. The authorities have ordered oh. all androids to be delivered to the nearest police station or army barracks immediately. If you are worried about your safety, dial the number on your screen and the authorities will come to collect your android. Under no circumstances should you try to destroy your android yourself. They are unpredictable We've got to find a warm place for Alice. They're conducting raids across the city. I'm pretty sure a lot of them got destroyed guns and stuff like that. That's terrifying. Oh, yeah. 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 I know they're only machines, but they they look like just people. People who want to be free. Following the android crisis and the neutralization of all military androids, American forces in the Arctic have been forced to withdraw, leaving the way clear for the Russian army. But according to some sources, the Russian forces also seem mysteriously to have withdrawn. The Kremlin has made no comment for the moment, but it is quite possible that the Russian army has been confronted with a similar crisis among its own androids. The chairman of the United Nations, Douglas Cromwell, has called for the organization of an... 
Somebody. Talk to somebody. Who is it? Find a warm place. Okay. Oh, perfect. Right here, darling. Oh, right here. Have a seat, darling. RA9 all over the place. How do you feel? I'm hot and cold at the same time. She's getting sicker. Okay. Stay with her. I'll try to find this Marcus. The last boat and the terminal's on the other side of town. We haven't got much time. We'll leave as soon as we have passports. Something I have to tell you. It's about Alice. We'll have lots of time to talk on the bus. I'll be back. Stay with Alice. <laughs> you found us. Thanks to me. I thought we were doing this peacefully. What Cut happened to that? Well, someone's breaking out. Oh. Sheer carnage. There were androids all over the square. Ready. And then the police arrived and well, they opened fire. I know they're only machines, but they they look like just people. People who want to be What am I looking at? Don't catch anybody's eye. Okay, well that's good, but what am I am I is there more that I need to look at? Thing I need to get up and look at. Free. Following the Android crisis and the neutralization of all military oh God, looks like that's a American forces and doctor center type deal. Yeah. The Arctic have been forced to withdraw, leaving the way clear for the Russian army. But according to some sources, talk to her maybe. The Russian forces oh. also seem mysteriously to have to be doing. The Kremlin has made no comment for the moment. But it is quite yeah, they're repairing that the Russian there. army has been confronted with a similar crisis. You're lost. You're That's looking for her. You're looking for yourself. Okay, back to Kara. Okay, back to Kara. A new stage has been used. Find Marcus. Where the heck is Marcus at? Maybe you've got to run into me. They're going to kill us all. I don't want to watch the news anymore. I want to find Marcus. I'm willing to fight. There he is. The Found him. Are you Marcus? There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Maybe you should stay here a while. Maybe you're right. You might be safer here until things calm down. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports you can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. Thank you. You said you're with a little girl, right? Mm -hmm. You know that humans hate us. Why are you protecting her? No difference, secret. She needs me. 
then I need her. It's as simple as that. Well, I was gonna look at something else, but apparently I don't need to look at something else. Alice. No freaking way! No freaking way! Are you serious? Are you fucking serious? You knew from the beginning. You just didn't want to see it. How did she remember? She wanted a mom. And you wanted someone to care for. You needed each other. What difference does it make? Do you love her any less now that you know she's one of us? Alice loves you, Carol. She loves you more than anything in the world. She became the little girl you wanted, and you became the mother she needed. Forgetting who you are, to become what someone needs you to be. Maybe that's what it means to be alive. The, the crazy thing is, is I kind of had a feeling because of what she said at the other place of we, you know, why do they hate us? And I wonder how she got her chip removed. Unless her dad did that from beating her so much. Well, you know, it's still like there. So like... Kara, is there something wrong? Hug distance. Together forever, won't we, Kara? Yes. It doesn't change anything. Forever. That's why I hate some people sometimes. The second you tell them anything really personal and interested. Oh, family now! <laughs> The second you tell some people anything, they automatically just hate you. Yeah, we might I have to re-record. That. that way too, we're running over. We're short on blue blood of- I'm actually gonna stop it right here. Uh, I'm gonna continue, obviously, because we're in a section where I don't wanna, like, screw save. with, or we, and we can't save, so. Um, we'll be back. If it turns out that it's not that long as I thought it was, I'll add it, but if it's over 60 minutes, unfortunately, I won't be able to add this. So, we'll see you in the next, uh, segment. See you in a bit.